Hey and welcome back to The Revolution and a brand new video surrounding one of the overlooked models is featured in the return of Daniel Bryan Showcase. Earlier today we revealed that WWE 2K19 will feature the return of 2K Showcase mod with this year's showcase being dedicated to the American Dragon Daniel Bryan. Along with many iconic matches, fans will have the opportunity to unlock a variety of historic arenas, bonus attires, WWE superstars and championship designs by completing objective based matches covering Daniel Bryan's blockbuster WWE career so far. By completing the objective based matches, fans will have the opportunity to unlock the bonus content with one of the 11 matches to be featured in the showcase revival being the WrestleMania 30 feud between Daniel Bryan and Triple H. As part of the feud between Triple H and Daniel Bryan, CEO Stephanie McMahon herself became a focal part of the feud, often intimidating Bryan at every opportunity and even attacking Bryan post-match at WrestleMania after a loss for Triple H on the grandest stage of them all. In the past, managers featured in the showcase mod are given temporary or iconic attires instead of factual attires related to the showcase match itself, usually to the dismay of many nostalgic fans. In this case, however, we get our very first look at Stephanie McMahon's manager model in 2K19, sporting her WrestleMania 30 manager attire. Now granted it's not a full up close version of Stephanie, we can see that she is indeed wearing a replica of a jacket and shorts as seen in the match and I for one think she looks fabulous. As one tiny little nitpick, it doesn't seem like Stephanie's sporting that same hairstyle as seen at WrestleMania 30 but instead the model leaves last year. As far as Stephanie's manager model goes however, I for one think they've captured Stephanie's true essence at WrestleMania 30 and I just can't wait to see what cutscenes have included as part of this historic feud. In my previous video, I also discussed the potential of AJ Lee being featured as part of the showcase as in my opinion both CM Punk and AJ Lee were a huge factor in Daniel Bryan being over as a heel and without them I don't think we'd have seen that successful heel Daniel Bryan run. The love triangle between the trio opened up so many different matches for AJ Lee including a special guest referee match which would be a great way for 2K to reinstate the game mod back into this year's game. If 2K were indeed to feature AJ Lee as part of the showcase there are so many awesome attires that could be included as part of the mod including that iconic Kane inspired attire featured in the tag team match between Kane and Daniel Bryan taking on CM Punk and Sheamus. Speaking of Sheamus, 2K could also highlight the match that started it all for both AJ Lee and Daniel Bryan when Sheamus beat Daniel Bryan in mere seconds thanks to that kiss of death from AJ Lee. As I said in my earlier video, I do think the chance of Punk being involved in this year's game are highly unlikely due to the core case between CM Punk and WWE, but who knows, maybe AJ Lee could make the cut due to the rumoured talks between AJ Lee and WWE for the upcoming all women's pay per view evolution. Well those are my brief thoughts and theories regarding some possible women's content in this year's 2K showcase mode but I want to know what you think about Stephanie's manager attire as well as your thoughts on whether AJ Lee should be featured as part of the 2K showcase. Don't forget to stay tuned to the revolution for all the latest WWE 2K19 women's roster news, footage and so much more.